do you think should be the values of a good footballer? Um, that they, sh they should have good teamwork, um, they have good sportsmanship. If, if, what, if one's a captain, they should lead the team to victory. We are on our way to Fitzrovia, where we are going to be talking about what we have done today. Behind me is the H-Pod, and next to it is the Cumberland Pitch. And also, next to the H-Pod is the Doctors. Also behind the Cumberland Pitch is the Cumberland Park. And we will be meeting you here. I want the other group to come here because I think it's really attractive and it's a, it's a good size football pitch. And behind the football pitch is a park where there's lots of activities you can do. I think it's a really good area because lots of people come here every day and they like to have a lot of fun. When I really started playing football, I really liked, I, I tried being a goalkeeper and I think it was really quite cool being a goalkeeper. My, so then my parents thought, okay, okay, I'll buy my son some gloves and then when they did, I started using them. Well, it does mean a lot because I've been a goalkeeper for quite a long time and these are quite old because I've been diving. I'm going to keep keeping them in my um, cabinet and and just look look back at them and then I think, oh yeah, when I was young, I really was good at goalkeeper. This is the area which we have to go through to get to Fitzrovia. All right. Hi there, I'm joined by Lumi here, who's been living in this area for some time now. So Lumi, what do you think about this area? Like, your opinion on it? My opinion is it's like peaceful area and it's like calm and it's nice to play for. Normally there's no more, like no troubles around. We've got quality, talented people around here to play football. I think it'll be a challenge for other people to come in. It was actually quite weird how I got this medal because it all started in Cumberland Market. We were just having a kickabout and um, a couple of people from Camden approached us and they asked us to join this football tournament they were hosting in a couple of weeks. So we made our team and we came along and there was loads of people there, loads of teams. Um, it was quite like it was quite nervous because we were just like a team just made up. Our other teams were like academies and they were they had training and coaches and stuff. We were just like from the streets, like straight there. So we didn't really know anything what was going on. And so as soon as, as soon as we played our first match, we knew we, it was going to be hard, didn't it? It was going to be a tough challenge because we've never played these people before. Uh, when we got to the final, it was quite hard. Played a very good team. We were losing 3-0 and on the second half we came back because our captain was right, really supportive and telling us to give it all we can. And we catched up 3-3 and then in penalties we won 4-5. This medal is probably most important of all the medals I have because this medal represents all the determination, the sweat, um, the hard work that we put in to get that comeback and that victory in the penalty shootout. This is my school. These are the hopscotch boxes, the snakes and ladders. There's loads of fun things you can do. Up there is all the school building where all the classes are. And we hope you visit us sometime. My object is a football. Well, I used to watch it with my dad and I support Man United, so like I really like Wayne Rooney. I just I love to play with football with my dad in the park. Like every now and again, I played with him when I was young, up until now. So football's a good sport, and I really enjoy it. This used to be our football pitch. Yeah, and from years like two or three, we we were allowed to play on this football pitch. Loads of the drama went down here. We used to even train on these football pitches for matches with other schools. This is where we mostly developed our skills. I broke my finger here also. What's special about my bike is, is, at, least, is at least 20 years old and it was, has been restored to a really nice standard by me now. It was given by a project which is run by Camden and the, the local youth club. It helped me like, gain more skills, more confidence. The bikes. Yeah, I mostly tra travel by bike, even if I have a free Oyster car, because you know bikes can travel through roads quickly. You know they could weave in and out through cars, between cars. They could even take some routes which cars can't take. In front of us, that blue big building, that's the hospital. 
Zoom in? Yeah. And r right now, as you can see, we are walking to Fitzrovia. Hi, my name is Ayub and right behind me is the BT Tower. It is a very famous landmark in the Fitzrovia area. I am looking forward to see you soon. First, I went to Sports Direct. I bought this lovely ball. I got home, I started playing with it. Well played, boys. But then it was really hard. I, I tried doing stuff, but then I couldn't do it because it was really hard and my foot kept on hurting. But then, after a while, I got used to it. And now, I just like this ball and I can do kick-ups with it and everything. So we're almost here. And we'll be meeting up with the rest of the group and discussing what we have done today. Hi, my name's Kennedy. I'm 11 years old and I came from Ritz Rovio. This medal, it may be silver and you may have come second, but it's important to me because even though we came second, there was a lot of other teams there, Pro Touch, Summers Town, like lots of other academy teams. And we, like in a youth project, so we're not like an academy. And we came a long way and we got to the finals and um, we played a good game, but they beat us by one goal, so that that's that's the story behind this. I'm really proud to have this. But um, I got more, but this is my first one, so that's why I'm really proud of it. If I ever became a f footballer, let's say if I get interviewed, I would show all my medals, and this would be my first one. We are going down is that Tony? into is that Tony? Fitzrovia. Yeah, you can do it for him. There you go. Now, here's our Whoa, honey, coach. Here's our weird coach. Are you, are you filming me? Mr. Tony. Yeah. Tony? Coach at Fitzroy Youth in Action. Right, Say on. something. I did. I'm a coach at Fitzroy Youth in Action. My name is William. I'm in the Fitzroy office right now. I'm going to show you the trophies we were back in the days. I like football because it's a team effort game and you can get lots of chances to be to work with different people that you have to know. I choose football as my object because it is a good game and you put all you got in it. You have a lot of sportsmanship and there's a lot of courage in it. I hope we can have a great game of football together.